course we are able. We are the great descendants of our ancestors. What is the US expect? We're talking about black excellence in its finest. So we move with our take home points that Nigerians have the power to bring the change that they seek, that they so desire. Nigerians have the power, or the caliphate Nigerians, because that's who you guys are. You live in the Usman Danfodio estates. You do have the power. And to empower you, I would say the indigenous peoples have the power to bring change. Yes. The constitutional force major gives you the right and the power. It is an orderly process that is based on UNDRIP, the United uh, Nations. Um, declaration, was, declaration for Indigenous People's Rights. Declaration for Indigenous People's Rights, yes. yes. An international law. So it's not based by chaka boom, chaka boom, like, okay. you know, the other one is in the other person's uh, pockets and all kinds. No, this is based on Andre. But right, a lot of them are repenting, you know, a lot of the disciples of that ceremonial. Uh, 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 <laughs> I see them on there that are repenting and coming out. And that's what we want you to do. Come around, come around and come understand what we're doing so that it will make more sense. Sorry, please go, go ahead. <laughs> so we say, so demand, we say that you demand sh to the shutdown and preparation for 2027 election. Don't let say, uh, okay, I want it. Oh, mosquito voice. <laughs> Don't let him trick you into going to another election because that's what they want. It's all about their ego. It's all about their private parties. never about you. So we must shut down the preparation for 2027 national elections to have transitioning for constitutional renegotiation with ethnic nations and have the multi-regional referendums in order for us to decide on the change that we want because we know that sovereignty belongs to the people. So right now, your sovereignty belongs to Peter B and his friends. They're there using it as a way, they're using it as a debate to go and serve their colonial masters and get favor. That's what it's all about for them. It's not about the change that you truly seek. And even if he becomes your president, he will never bring you the change that you seek. It's always gonna be that house with that foundation that somebody is plastering so that it will look like it's not about to fall. Indigenous ethnic nations, we are together for the joint break from Fulani Caliphate bondage. We are together for the joint jailbreak from the Nigerian Caliphate territory. Indigenous people, we are together for the joint break for what Fulani Caliphate bondage. Sovereignty matters. Sovereignty is all important. And we cannot end without reminding you that Ninas is right. The work has been done. All you have to do is to open up the door, pick up your present and open it so that you can live life and live life abundantly. And here's Anina's proposition. We know on the right-hand side, we are here on transition. This is what we want Peter to be. If he truly cares about the people, for those of you following him and wearing his uh, his uh, bada, as aqua, you're wearing it as dress, as a headscarf, please tell him that we want to transition now. That's what we want. If he truly cares for the people, and once we take the constitution down, it will be our campaign for you. But before we do that, let's transition now and do it the right way. We have nothing against election, but not election that will renew our slavery. Mm -hmm. So please, let's put an end to it. And of course, here is our uh, announcement. Uh, Tuesday, Tuesday is a very good day. It's a day for you to tweet and send this information out. It's a day for you to sit around and send information out. And uh, even on Mondays, for those of you that are still staying home because of the criminals that will not allow you to move forward, there's a wayek or something going on and you guys are still enforcing uh, uh, sit at home on Mondays, you know, destroying our economy, destroying the future of our children because you guys are ignorant. That are the talks now. They, they have been hired to do that. They're doing, it's the enemy that hired them to do that. And, they, and it's working for them. So please do not watch alone. Help others by sharing to get them informed. Subscribe, love, and uh, thank you so much for your time. For those of you that are, you know, ever, ever, everly available for this show, we thank you. We appreciate you. We are not going anywhere. Okay, well, the same way the enemy walk five hundred years or how many years they painstakingly near me. Hannah, I get make it until our people will wake up from sleep and say, "Eh, what is going on?" He said, "So we, we are going nowhere." So we thank you, brothers and sisters. Have a wonderful day. May you remain blessed. We will win this war. 
Don't let don't let anything deter you. Don't let the number, the, you know, deter you. Don't let anything. The work has been done. Our people are getting it. The indigenous people are getting it. We're using Ogene. Ogene to wake up our people anymore. Not, we are not on internet. We have Ogene. We are going from village to village yes. and waking up our people, bringing them to the town square. Yes. Like our ancestors did, and we're giving them the messages. Flyers yes. are being shared. So for those of you thinking you can block what we're doing, you're dreaming. Flyers are going out. People are waking up. Our people are reading the information, both in Igbo and English. Before you know it, the job will be completed. The yes. question then, are you going to be part of it? What will be your contribution? So make sure you're doing your part in your part of your neighborhood. Thank you. Until next week, take care. Bye.